all right what's going on guys it's gsr here so basically i wanted to talk to you guys today about um why i don't like the defensive bars um and personally i think the shit should be nerfed um shit is fucking crazy now of course we already know that you can up two you can up three you can delay your wake up you can tech roll forwards you can tech roll backwards you can randomly swing like a wild man sometimes you can just ran you, you know randomly just jump uh sometimes it like when you go for your oki you just like you you play super cautious which fucks up your oki slash mini and even if you time it correctly you still are at risk of getting hit with an up three so the odds are even greater for the person that's playing defensive so it, that's just completely bogus and dumb as hell and sometimes your fatal blow will come out like if you if you just randomly mash it or some shit or if you time it just when the opponent is about to hit you dude that shit is insane now we're gonna get to something a little bit deeper right um you ever notice like when you chip somebody out and both of their defensive bars disappear and then the next round starts but then all of a sudden their sh their fucking defensive bars just rebuild instantly um Um, I have a problem with that because if I chipped you out that bad, that those bars should reload slow. Like, I don't agree with the fact that, you know, your shit is already rebuilt it and it's fully rechargeable. And not only that, you could break out another combo. And speaking of breaking out of combos, bro, I am not in agreement with this fucking, uh, breakaway system that they got going on here because, um... Your defensive bars will recharge, right? Uh, within a certain amount of time, right? Which is not very long, especially if you know how to defend yourself and you know what you're doing, right? That shit is crazy in itself because like, uh, I was in a match and every time I put this nigga in a combo, I put this nigga in a combo three fucking times, right? And this nigga broke out three times. And then he had a fourth uh, time well, he almost did it, right? But I but I uppercut the shit out of his ass. That shit is crazy, bro, how many times you can break out of a combo in this game. Like, because of the way that the uh, this shit is built up. I remember you had to build your fucking meter, bro. And you had to use it wisely. I'm talking about wisely, my nigga. Like, I'm not talking about, like, no, no, uh, like, it was your life. Your meter was your life. In this game... You just have way too many fucking options, bro. Like you have way too many options. You can you could do too much, bro. Like that's all I'm trying to say. You know what I'm saying? It's it's fucking crazy, right? And not only that, right? You got access to an up three that pretty much invincibility frames on it and shit. But then again, people say it's armor, so you know, I'll just go with that. And it's like you could break out of combos easily. Uh, you could just do all kinds of shit, bro. It's like, yo, this fucking shit is ridiculous. And then when you chip them out, bro, it's like their shit regenerates super fucking fast. So now you still have to deal with that bullshit. You get what I'm saying? Like, it's like, yo, th this defensive meter, bro, is very friendly because I remember you had to build up your meter, bro, and you had to use it wisely. You know what I'm saying? If you get like uh, an EX move, do you want to save the EX move? But sometimes you can't even save the EX move. Sometimes you got to use that shit so you can cash out on damage or set something up possibly, depending on what character you're using, right? And when you ran out of that meter, you still didn't have any, uh, you know, defense meter. You know what I'm saying? Because you didn't reach the second level of it yet. You had to work to get the meter. And if you didn't have a meter, you took a combo and sometimes a fat ass combo depending on if you just keep breaking out of your combo you know what i'm saying that's why people were saying like uh with certain characters like jackie briggs back in mkx she can build up really good amounts of meter and the reason why they make videos like that is because that's a really big deal because technically if you ain't really got no meter bro you can't i mean you can do well without meter in a way but like meter is kind of like life that's your life right there you know what I'm saying? In this game, that's not the case. Like, that's not the case at all. Because you got so many different options to pretty much just prevent uh, 
the opponent from doing certain shit. And I got to respect you so much that I have to back up and play cautious, which allows you to advance forward with a jump or advance forward with a uh, far reaching normal or special move. And then I end up getting hit off guard because I didn't think that's what, you know, what was going to happen. So, like I said, man, this is the reason why I don't like the defensive options in this game. This game is very noob friendly. And I don't like saying noob because it makes me seem like I'm, I'm bashing beginner players. But they are definitely catering to people who are beginner players in this game. I'm, it's just too much aiding here. Because you remember remember your ultimate attack, dude? Now you, now you got your fatal blow at your disposal and shit like that. Like, it's like, dude, get the fuck out of here with this nonsense, dude. You know what I'm saying? You had to work to get that shit and to use it correctly. And, and then you got shit like this to where you have all these options, my nigga. It's like, yo, get the fuck out of here with this stupid ass shit. I don't, I don't like the system that they got going on here. I don't think this is balanced. I don't think this makes sense at all because like, I remember you had to work for your meter and now literally you don't have to work for your meter that shit will charge back up on its own so all you have to do is worry about trying to open up this nigga until you get um a bar a meter and once you get a bar meter and you see that you got a bar meter then you can hit confirm that and get a combo and do whatever the hell you're trying to do like i said man overall this shit is just fucking ridiculous my nigga like uh, like like nah this is I, I don't agree with the defensive options in this game i don't even agree with the whole meter system I think the whole meter system is stupid. I think it's cool. The design of it is pretty cool. And I like the idea behind it. It's pretty neat in a way. But this is not like... This This is on some bullshit. Just like that dude said in the background. Screw you! Yeah, that's how the fuck I feel right now. Because like you're catering to beginner players. That's exactly what this is doing. Because like if you think about it. You have way too many options to get up. When my hit advantage is like 20 frames. And you just out this motherfucker completely per perk the fuck up to where you can do anything at any given moment and i gotta make a good read knowing for a fact you're gonna you're gonna up uh three me up to me shit like that and sometimes that shit sometimes you don't even fucking do that you just get out the corner for free you know what i'm saying because of because you know you're gonna fear the defensive options you know what i'm saying i, I just think that uh the defensive options are uh really bogus um, and you know, and this is the reason why I'm saying that the defensive options are bogus because I remember you had to work for that fucking meter, my nigga. You literally had to, you know, it was a crucial part. That meter was your life, not your life bar, but the meter was your life. And, and you had to work for that shit. That's why there were certain characters that were really good at getting a whole bunch of, uh, uh, meter building damage on you and shit when they're hitting you constantly like there were certain characters that had like multi hitting strings and shit and that would build up like damn near 50% of a bar of meter and the opponent got to worry about that shit too you know what I'm saying and you had to save your bar of meter your, your two bars of meter or something like that like you don't use it on the first round you use it on the second round when it's crucial especially if the enemy won the other round you know what I mean? Like, shit like that. In this game, bro, you could break out like one, two, three, sometimes fucking four times, bro, and out of each fucking combo, bro, and this shit is ridiculous. And then you have access to your fucking fatal blow, which is unbelievably stupid. Because, like, it, it's neat. I see what they're doing here, all right? But, but, but you have your fatal blow at your disposal at any given fucking moment. And it has armor on it, for Christ's sake. I hit noob side by fucking four times, bro, and this nigga had like infinite armor and shit. You know what I'm saying? Even if you time it correctly, sometimes that shit, sometimes they fatal blow just wins. You know what I mean? Like this shit is crazy, bro. This shit is crazy, and this is the reason why I don't like the defense, the, just the whole meter system in general. Cause this, this shit is bogus, bro. Like you don't have to work for shit in this game. Your shit just recharges if you chip the opponent out, and that's another thing, bro. Why the fuck do you allow the opponent? To be to, to still live when they should be dead already off of the chip damage so instead they allow you to use both of your defensive options or the game automatically uses both of your defensive bars right and it prevents the opponent from uh chipping you out all the way just yet before you die right so you still kind of have a chance there right and then once you're chipped out and you and you do like get knocked out i'm not gonna say die because you don't die yet but you get knocked the fuck out Right, the next round start, I look over there at the opponent's defensive options or like his defensive bars, and this nigga is literally 
re it's recharging. Like, it's literally recharging, my nigga. Like, I'm just like, yo, what the fuck is this? And he had, he had both of his bars filled the fuck up, bro. I was just like, nigga, no, bro. No, hell no. And not only that, man, the fucking offensive options are bogus as shit, especially when it comes to zoners, man, because they can stay away. They can waste two bars of their meter and motherfucking meter is literally building up on its own while you're zoning the fuck out of my character. And then you could teleport her on the other side. And guess what? You got meter again. You know what I'm saying? It's it's dumb as shit. Like, you don't have to work for nothing in this game, my nigga. Like, you really don't. Like, it's dumb as hell. Like, that's why I don't support this uh, system. Like, this shit is bogus as shit, bro. Like, I, I just, I was just sitting there, sh like, sh like, shook, bro. I was like, fuck this noise. Like, this shit is dumb. Like, you know what I'm saying? You just get out for free, bro. It kind of reminds me of Armageddon to where, like, you could break out, like, three times and shit like that. That's kind of what it reminds me of, like, that type of mechanic. I feel like that's what this mechanic kind of is. You know what I'm saying? You like a cat with, with a few amount of lives. That's what the fuck you are. You know what I'm saying? Like, I remember you had to work for that meter, and if you didn't have the meter or you broke out, you had to take risk of getting your ass fucked up and getting put into a combo. You know what I'm saying? And if you ain't had no meter for armor, you were, you were, you were fucked. And now you just... You can just have all this shit at your disposal and it recharges on its own. Yay! Great idea. Nah, this, this shit is very beginner friendly. I'll even take it a step further and say noob friendly. This is way too noob friendly. So, like I said, uh, this is all I really had to say about why I don't like the, the, you know, the defensive options or just in general the whole system. Um, you know what I'm saying? Um, but with that being said, uh, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Um, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.